Hi there and welcome to the first Excel in 60 second screencast with bradedgar.com. My name is Brad and today I'll be going over how to build formulas into Excel tables for easy dynamic calculations that change as your table data changes. First off, we're going to select a and highlight any single cell within the range of cells that we're working with. In our case, I'm just going to select A1. I'm going to hit Control T. That's actually going to set us up for uh, the ability to create a table here. So I'm going to hit OK once the Create Table option comes up. We're then going to go down to the bottom of one of the rows that we want to summarize. In my case, we're going to select the Order Price column header. I'm going to hit Equals Sum. Open the bracket. We're going to select the range of that whole field range by using the control shift down arrow that's going to select that whole range starting from the top I'm going to close up the bracket here and you'll notice really quickly here that the sum is going based off of the range of table 5 and order price um, so it's the whole table it references and then order price as the field as soon as I hit enter it's going to automatically do the summary uh, and give us the sum of all of the uh, records within the order price field next thing you can do quickly is insert another record and you'll notice that uh, that's actually going to update our total sum down at the bottom here all of the other fields you can now use this drop down arrow on and do any calculation or formula you'd like so in this case I'm going to use average on this one and it's going to give me the average unit price for uh, that column there so that's all for today and please do come back and enjoy more 60 second tips with bradagger.com